we will be talking about one of the chapters from the book that is the last leaf the last leaf was written by o henry o henry is the pseudonym of william sydney potter that means william sydney potter is original name of o henry so in this story he talks about friendship and sacrifice every friendship requires a sacrifice however how big and how small it might be but there is no friendship which is without the sacrifice so today we talk about this particular story of two friends they are john c and sue both are young artists and live in a flat in the month of november john c falls sick in spite of all the medications and all the efforts so along with the doctors which were made but john c did not recover so started feeling worried because she loved her friend a lot finally one day john c was murmuring something and so happened to listen to her and when she listened she heard that john c was stop looking at out of the window at the ivy creeper ivy creeper there were number of leaves and she was counting backward on asking john c replied that on the last leaf once it falls she would die that means John C had described her her life to the last leaf. The day the last leaf falls, she would die. So that is the autumn season, and the leaves will fall. And the same way, the will to live also was losing for John C. Getting to the better situation, John C rushed to a person named. John Bergman he was 62 years of age and was a painter he was a wonderful man who lived next to their flat he had a desire to create a masterpiece but number of years has passed but the masterpiece was not created he had a desire but these days he was sick when john c brought behrman saw behrman she was very happy then she told all the story and that night it was strong and thundery and everything was abnormal sue was worried because all with the thundery the last leaf would fall and the next morning when sue and john c got up so john c was very sure the last leaf might have fallen and she would die but interestingly in spite of all the storm all the thundering all the wind which had blown the last leaf did not fall and john c started believing that she has a ray of hope that she could live when the doctor came he said that he is going to the burial of a man who died last year last night on asking they came to know that john behrman had died because he was suffering from pneumonia when she went to near to the window she saw the leaf was not falling on seeing to it she realized and happened come to know that john behrman was painting the last leaf on the creeper john she thought that the leaf had not fallen actually the leaf had fallen but john behrman what he did he painted a leaf exactly the same 
and this gave a hope to live to John C. But as a result, a sacrifice of John Batman made made by John was wonderful. He died of he was suffering from pneumonia, being whole night in the winter. He died next morning. So this story tells us, as I was talking about in the beginning, the story gives us very clear idea that every friendship, every responsible person who loves to be in friendship will have to make the sacrifice. So in this chapter we learn that friendship requires the sacrifice, however it might be a small or a big sacrifice. I hope the characters of John C, characters of Sue and characters of John Bahraman will help us to get and imbibe the good values in our lives of friendship, of love, of caring nature, of taking responsibility of one another with whom we come in contact with. Students, I believe and hope this particular video with this particular message will help you to understand the importance of friendship and all the accidental expenses it carries along with. Thank you very much. Wishing you a wonderful day.